Nyberger. This is interesting for West Ham at the moment. They've got a 3-2 advantage. Defence coming back now, though. Brooking. Padden in a position to let one go, which he does well! Oh, what a goal! By Graham Padden! Really got hold of that with his left foot, which, of course, is his favourite foot. And the goalkeeper really was nowhere near it. Look at this. They had a 3-2 break here. And a fine left foot. The goalkeeper may have been slightly unsighted, but he got nowhere near it. Seven is Nickel for Billy Bonds. And a fine effort, in fact, hit the post. Neuberger wanting a corner for that. A good effort to see whether Mervyn Day had it covered come forward a long way at Neuberger and in fact it looked as that may well have come off Keith Robson who was back in defence indirect free kick it's curling quite a lot Nickel and only just a whisker past the post the ball came out from the defence it's uh, Lampard who came from behind Nickel's left foot shot curling away came off a defender Holtzenbein faced by Padden. Grabowski. Jim is trying to find room in the box. Not succeeding. Tackle by Bonds. Grabowski. This is Neuberger. Letting one go! And I don't think Day could have seen too much of that. Billy Neuberger ties it up at one each. Look at the mess of players between the goalkeeper and the shot. 1-1. One, one. Offside against Jennings. Flag is up. West Ham supporters with flags in the air, but the goal will not count. Jennings offside, looking at it again from the goalkeeper's viewpoint. Four players well forward for the West Germans. Good save by Day from Wenzel. Looking at the shot again. Day getting down well. Still with his left knee uh, bandage, you may have noticed. Is Nickel to Corbell. To Klaus finally worked goal really finally worked goal spilled right across the face of the goal and Klaus's final shot Nyberger coming from the free position at the back showing good pace too Taylor's clearance but only to Kobel Holzenbein and only just past the post yeah, Nickel yeah, shot right. from Holzenbein square ball and it curved away pressure they were put under at the start of the second half was to immediately take the game to Eintracht Keith Robson and Holland following it in but the goal will not stand Looked as though it was flicked by Holland's hand. Look at it again. But it wasn't, in fact. A protest from Grabowski. Nickel. Holtzenbein. Off the line by Graham Patton from Beverungen. Forward for Brooking. And Brooking going in with a chance. Didn't really get his shot away. Might still. Jennings on the far post is given offside. Referee line play to continue. No, he's not. He's given the free kick. Here's the substitute who just come on. Vidal number 13. Vidler. Holland. Robson. Good save by the goalkeeper. But they really are creating some chances at West Ham. Let's look at this as it came across from Patton. 
both Holland and then Robson. The goalkeeper did well. Nick Kale put, playing it forward to Holzenbein. Nick Kale shots. And just out of harm's way. Benzel touched it to him. Question now what the referee has stopped off for injuries and stoppages. Bonds making his back pass. Padden. Holland. Lampard might have a crack and does. And there indeed goes the final whistle. And the West Ham supporters are on their feet, applauding what they see as the basis of an overall victory. A 2-1 defeat away from home. The goal, their goal scored by Padden. And then Neuberger, the equaliser, and Klaus giving Eintracht a 2-1 advantage to take to West Ham in a fortnight's time. But surely West Ham, after giving an intelligent, composed, sensitive performance here in enemy country.